Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. I am at my mom's house. My grandma is here and she needs somebody with her just so that way she don't fall or anything like that. So I came over here this morning, but I did not do my makeup at the house because I was running late and I didn't want my grandma to wake up and nobody was here. So um, I am going to do that now. Um, welcome back to another vlog. <sighs> life's been crazy, life's been hectic. Um, right now, the easiest filming that I'm going to get done is vlogging. So that is what we are going to do is the vlog. But yeah, you guys can go ahead and watch me do my makeup. I'm not gonna talk. I have to do at least some of my devotional time this morning. So I'm going to listen to my Proverbs of the day, which is Proverbs chapter 12, because today is November 12th. And then um, I'm gonna probably go get my BSF stuff out of the car and do that as well. Um, just because I didn't get to do my read and write the words. So I was like, you know what? We have two chapters due next week of BSF. So I'll just do my BSF work. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get into this and start getting ready and whatnot.
All right, you guys, I am done. I'm gonna get Jojo dressed and then I am also going to And then I'm going to see what he wants for breakfast. And that is it, you guys. And then I'll be taking my grandma to some stores and probably my sister if she feels left out. All right, you guys. So after I finished um, doing my makeup, I got my nephew and then I had, I was just like cleaning their, my niece's and nephew's room for my sister, putting up their laundry for her. Cause if you didn't know, she just had her baby. And if you know, you're not supposed to do you're not supposed to do too much whenever you whenever you first have a baby. Like you're supposed to wait like six weeks or you can get like hernias and things like that, which I did and that's why I had a hernia. And so, yeah, so I just did that for her, cleaned her room for her, put up her and her husband's laundry for her. And then now me, my grandma and her are out having lunch. We are at the place, this place called Plaza. It's Mexican food, so yeah. Alright, so this is the restaurant we are at. Alright, you guys, we got our we got our food. I got beef enchiladas with red sauce, steamed veggies, and rice. What'd you get? I got the queso enchiladas with Mexican papas and rice. And then grandma got a chile relleno and a queso enchilada with veggies and rice. So we all got a little bit of what everybody got. And then the kids got fries. What's for your You call them Frenchies? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey. Hey guys, so after we left from lunch, we went to go pick up the boys. And then my grandma was tired. She needed a nap. We were going to go to stores, but she was tired. So I just... We just went back to my mom's and hung out there and now we are home. The boys had picture day today, so they look all handsome. Let me see, guys. Which one is it? But um, I'm about to make an um, I'm gonna keep pushing that. I'm about to make dinner, so yeah. That is what I'm gonna do. Because we have um, a little church thing on biblical parenting so we are going to go to that how high do I need to have these okay so that's gonna gotta preheat the oven I'm just making spaghetti and meatballs and then I need to change I need to put my load of laundry for today into the dryer yeah y'all can change y'all can put on some sweats and a shirt single time you look at me i lose it too why don't you come sit next to me let things happen naturally like you used to be
So we have about three minutes before I gotta do anything. We're not gonna have time to eat before we go to church. So I told the boys to grab a snack and I'm going to eat some pomegranate. So for my pasta noodles, I've started adding chicken bouillon. Well, the better than chicken bouillon to my pasta water. And it's so good. It sticks to your noodles just as if you were to cook rice and add it to your rice so good i love pomegranates but i can't cut them open because it gives me what mexicans would call asco and it's like where ugh, like the inside of a pomegranate it just looks disgusting makes you want to like scratch it and like kind of gag at the same time it's weird i'm like i'm gonna wait for these noodles to finish boiling i'm about to stir the meatballs and flip the toast and whenever the noodles are done boiling i'm going to cook the noodles in the pasta sauce for a little bit that way the sauce really sticks to the noodles. That's a trick that I learned off of Food Network too. Well, I just kind of do the bouillon thing on my own, but the trick with the pasta sauce, letting it cook in the pasta sauce for a while.
and pheromones The conversation flows A couple of hours See how it goes I really trust my senses Catch me if I fall So done with second guessing You seem to have it all In loving the for anything Emotional too soon You got my invitation Now the rest is up to you For me and you Get you over, treat you right We vibing like a high Kick it, rendezvous Make some time for me and you Get together, you and I We vibing like a high A high A Target to pick up a baby shower gift 
I'm running super late. So yeah, I'm probably gonna get there about 30 minutes late. I was supposed to be there at 10. It is 9.58 and I'm barely leaving the house and I still gotta stop at Target. So that is where I'm headed right now and I will see you guys there. All right, y'all, we are done. Since I have to head straight over there, I'm going to pack the bag here. My older sister always taught me to get something for mom, so her name is Megan, so I got her this little pink cup because if you know about breastfeeding, you know you have to stay hydrated, and I know it's not much, but I thought, you know, if she wanted a cup of coffee or something like that, she could use that. Her favorite color is black, which is so funny that I got the pink cup, but I got her these like little fuzzy house slipper things. I believe I remember her telling me she's very hot natured, so I didn't want to get her full socks, but you all know after you have a baby, it's good to keep socks on. So I got her those, and then I got her some breastfeeding care. And that is it. Um, yeah, so now I can stuff it. And then I bought me some new shoes because the ones I have on are busty and crusty, so I'll show y'all once I change them. I'll show y'all once I change my shoes what my old ones were looking like, and I kept feeling like a little poor girl every time I would wear them but they're like my favorite shoes to wear and I just didn't want to spend the $15 but today they were 20% off so I bought them I gotta come in here to do the paper because it's kind of windy gotta love West Texas is windy weather okay how am I gonna do this I'm pretty sure everyone expects me to be late. I'm late to everything. Except for like doctor's appointments and stuff. I'm always on time for those, but for like social events, Brian and I are always late. Always. And I think it's because we have to talk ourselves into going over and over and over again. So. We're just such homebodies that we don't like to do anything. I don't know if I told y'all, my older sister is the one that taught me to do something for mom and something for baby because mom can get forgotten about so so we did she's also having her fifth daughter so anyways let me change my shoes wow. okay cool cool that might fall again need my knife keep this on me for protection but also for things like this And these are what my old shoes look like, guys. So I really, really needed them. Really. All right, I'm about to go put this basket up. All right, into the baby shower we go. And I'm about to double check the address because even though I think I know where I'm going, I may not really know where I'm going. But yeah, I'll see you guys once we get there. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog there. Privacy, so yeah.